imagine this is the virus here and this is your antibody induced by the vaccine. Uh, in the in the wild type virus, the non-variants, uh, the antibody from the vaccine can bind well to the, the virus spike protein, the S protein. Mm. But when you have lots of mutations, what happens is that you have different shape changes uh, in the S protein that your antibodies induced by the vaccine can't bind as well to. Mm. And that reduces the protection uh, against uh, the virus for those variants. So mm. you have to update your vaccine or you have to try and avoid getting infected by the, the new variant that's not well protected by the vaccine. But the vaccine can bind well enough. The vaccine and antibodies can bind well enough to reduce severe disease and, and, and death, we think. And also you've got okay. T cell responses that can also attack the virus in different ways, uh, regardless of the SG mutations. So those mutations really change the way the virus, the shape of the virus and the protein coded by the virus. And that also helps it to escape vaccine immunity. And that's what we have to try and uh, combat with updated vaccines and or just reducing transmission by avoiding infected people.